Welcome back to Equisetum Gaming and our low honor playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. Starting off uh, where we left off in the previous episode here at Emerald Ranch, or near Emerald Ranch, after committing that uh, train robbery. We did pay off our bounty, but uh, we have a snake. And, uh, where'd it go? There it is. say drop it, I said skin it. <laughs> you get too close to the horse, you hit E to skin, and it says, now nah, we're gonna mount the horse instead. That's it, just throw it at the uh, Appaloosa's hooves. Real good, Arthur. But we are going to spend this a day doing a little different uh, gameplay. I think Arthur's honor is entirely too high, so we're gonna go out and just uh, rob a bunch of people, a bunch of campsites. And uh, what time is it? It is 7.30 in the morning. So we will... Oh. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that should have popped up sooner than this. That's from the regular playthrough. Uh, you notice the little 90.2% I think it said of completion. Yeah, that's our, our other game, our other save. Okay. Forget if we have anything for uh, Seamus or not to sell. Mm -hmm. Satchel. Yeah, we do have some stuff we can sell to Seamus. So we might as well do that. But yeah, we're gonna go out and do a little bit of honey, Hello, but uh, we're also go going to uh, oh, you got something for me? go on a bit of a... Hmm. Come across a few of these myself. I won't say crime spree exactly, but uh, we're gonna go oh, and uh, yes. see if we can do something the about the uh, honor situation. My load. You have more blood on you than a butcher. Looking to get something put together, huh? Um, yeah, I don't have anything I can craft. What about stuff to buy? No new weapons. We have ten moonshine. That's enough for now. We'll okay. Bring it up to an even twelve on the gun oil. Mm. Done. Okay. All right. Not a word to Wagner. Nor no one else. Of course not. Hey, let me pet you, puppy. <laughs> hey, boy. All right. There. Outfit is free of blood. And uh, I think we might head down to the stables, switch out horses before we head off and look for folk to rob. I need to uh, do a little bit of hunting for uh, 
feathers <laughs> so we can craft more arrows. They ran over a skunk. <laughs> Come on, girl. There's a camp down here. Let's see who it is. Looks like it's going to be O'Driscoll's. And I need to clean my gun. Guns. without the... Uh... There we go. Without yes, using dead eye. <laughs> Unfortunately. This doesn't do anything to our honor because they are rival gang. And well, nice. So we will be using that shortly. <laughs> yeah, but uh, we are making quite a bit of progress with our playthrough. I don't want to do the next mission quite yet because that is going to lead us into the series of events that uh, causes us to change camp. So, uh, I don't know. Um, I feel like this particular playthrough is going uh, faster than the previous one now. There, finally. But I think it's just that we're not spending every other episode exploring is part of the reason. I really doubt this series will uh, end up hitting the, you know, I think we're at 116 episodes now for the original playthrough. <laughs> Very neat. Alright. That's about it for this camp. It's really not much here. Is there a pack of yes, there is a pack of premium cigarettes. Covenant Americans. Okay. Lots of goat pigs. Everything else can be left. Alright. Anyways, onward. Let's <laughs> have another snake. There it is. This one's gonna be a little harder to hunt. Hey. 
Girl, easy. It's okay. Let's see it. I'm just waiting for it to get to the grass. Not that ain't gonna be hard. Damn it. Missed. Oh, no point in going after it now, because uh, just ruined that pelt. And snake meat is not that uh, useful. Alright. Where's there we need to get your dead eye? Here, need a chocolate bar. <laughs> okay. Well, the Springfield rifle. <laughs> Shoot that duck in the face. Yeah. <laughs> You've wasted enough time. <laughs> All right. And we are still looking for our fourth horse. Well, who do we have here? That's a fine steed. Got yes, some stable is. space for rent if you're interested. We haven't used uh, Solstice, so okay. we'll I'll saddle her up. Uh, attack and services. What kind of saddles do we have? I forget. You know, a horse can tell when you're using a cheaper saddle. All right. That's the original set. Yeah. That would look good on her. <laughs> you know, I, I've lived yeah. here my whole life. Seen we'll stick with the beaver trail saddle. I wouldn't change a thing. Mm. This is fast acting. If you need a break from that horse, they're always welcome back. Okay. Yeah. Well, it is now 11.30. So we're gonna head up into the mountains. And look for some fools camping along the road. Although this will probably go better at night. See what we run into. trouble we can get into. Morning. Don't you morning me. Yeah, previous episode was uh, a little rough. We uh, not do quite all that well in the shootout, but uh, we were certainly uh, 
concerned about uh, protecting our boys. Hey, partner. <laughs> and I've noticed something in my uh, private place. Out of there, stranger. Take it slow. Hey, that's a nice looking horse you have there. Yeah. Better name faster than mine, though. Ariel's my pride and joy. How about we head to the veteran's homestead? Sure. You? Sure, let's race. All right, let's race! Yeah. It's a nice looking horse, but I think it's a standard bread, just like uh, Solstice. I wouldn't mind stealing it from the guy, but we don't need two standard breads. So we run into a deer instead. Easy there, girl. There we go. Yeah. Almost there. to you huh all that stamina training for nothing Ugh. not a bad race maybe another time next time friends next time we'll get you you can write that down bye now <laughs> okay not a bad race So I can come. You want your hat hung? You're good. Oh. oh, don't kill me. Your train. Okay, girl. <laughs> yeah.
good save there around here. Killed the lady. Oh. <laughs> Don't do that. Take Seamus a new wagon. There were more chestnuts and sorrels in the game. Besides the uh, Suffolk punches that are pulling this wagon. And uh, I think it's. Oh, there's a chestnut pinto. And I think there's a chestnut Tennessee walker. There really aren't that many horses that are that really nice, bright, deep red. Even the online version, most of them they have to, they decide, oh, we're going to make it a strawberry roan, or we're going to make it a bay roan, or we're going to make it, you know, some sort of variation on the pinto paint colors. And I just like a nice red horse. But back when I uh, worked at uh, the quarter horse stable, the vast majority of horses that we had were um, blood bays or, you know, really nice red chestnuts like uh, the Suffolk Punch that is on the right here. Otherwise, uh, you know, we had a few liver chestnuts, we had a few uh, dark bays that came in for breeding. I think we had one uh, do not get in the road. I am trying. I need to get it turned around, Seamus. But, uh, that one, uh, dapple gray that would come in. But otherwise, everything was, uh, deal. Bays and chestnuts. This is for you. See you again <laughs> A little bit of a pay attack. Alright. I want to do that. Restock that. And now... Um, need to clean our guns.
that way. There we go. Nice and shiny now. And do have Granger's revolver. And that's pretty much it. Okay. That's good. It salts us a bit of a brush. Time is it now? Oh, about uh, 3.30. female because they're usually orange. At least in real life. Alright. And we rob the coach. Instead of going after a campsite. We were supposed to be going after campsites. here. First I find all this damage, then I find a stranger here. Care to explain? Yep. <laughs> How's that for an explanation? <laughs> you. Well, how about we just take you in the house? in that. Okay. <laughs> Pretty sure that is the dog. Yeah. Considering how it's running. You want to do that? Son of a bitch! <laughs> You're not gonna get away with that. It's just about to say. There's that guitar in there, in that uh, other room, and uh, 
I kind of wish we could uh, pick up instruments and take them back to camp. But uh, unfortunately, it's not part of the game. This, I mean, Javier doesn't necessarily need a new guitar, but I think it would be nice to take him a spare. He could teach uh, somebody else to play. Maybe one of the girls would like to learn to play. Anything else? Uh, why am I not using Eagle Eye? Okay, looks like just the... No, don't take out your knife. Grab the classic cupcakes. There we go. <laughs> do nothing dumb. Hey, back off! Stay back! Get off of Bad dog. Seeing as it's not an X or a paw print, I'm hoping that it's not dead. Switch outfits. Don't you cause me problems. I will stab you. How do you do? Let's go, girl. <laughs> one horse herd over there, one horse herd over here. Fox and chestnut, Morgan. And Bay Road. And liver chestnut. And of course, the Alameda. Alright. It is getting on towards sunset, so people should be camping now. Let's see if we can find ourselves another camp or two to rock. I think that is William's camp over there, so it's not worth trying to rob it. Because yeah, there's herbs hanging all over the tent. So, not a robbable camp. Yep. All right. We'll ride up into the mountains. What's this? A dead bison? Did it get hit by a train? <laughs> Steady little grey fox. I see smoke. And where there's smoke, there's people to rob. Shit. 
kill you again in hell, my friend. <laughs> you shot my horse, you bastard. Ah, you're gonna be all right. You shot my horse. We'll definitely kill you again in hell for that. I was gonna say, do we uh, not get the low honor for uh, killing a guy who kills our horse or tries to kill our horse? Anything else here? Not really. All I had was a pinto. Calm your solstice. I'll feed you. That'll make you feel better. Poor girl. Mm. Oh, poor horse. Got shot. What do I have to eat? I am like low on pretty much everything. Hello, eat that, Arthur. Thank you. Okay then, girl. Poor girl. Well, I guess I know what I'm doing in between episodes. I'm going to be hunting and cooking for Arthur. <laughs> Need to be a little quicker on the bow. Just trying to do things without that eye. I feel like I do too much or rely too much on that eye. But, uh, yeah, we'll figure it out as we go. in case we get ambushed by wolves. Yeah. Cook up some wolf meat. I see more stuff. What do you have, buddy? Yeah, these are the guys. This uh the still, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Better help them out, but uh I don't care about. Although cigarettes we will take. Alright, it's gonna make me take the crackers. Well, we could go into town and uh, 
sell a bunch of stuff. That's cute. Yep. It's moonshine. Loot the ammo box. Mm, just regular pistol cartridges, which we don't use. We use the special ammo where we can. We'll go to this side. Have some more moonshine and some more oat cakes for our good horse. I think that's it for here. Alright. Yeah. There's a deer. You done good, girl. <laughs> yes, you have. Okay. That was Adler. Mm. Yeah, we're just yep. not too good on the uh, horse front. Because, uh... That's uh, amazing. No. It's a rabbit. That's not good. Oh, well. There we go. It's okay. Yeesh. They're all dead. All of them. We killed all of them. The whole pack. <laughs> I know, girl. Just give me a second. Sorry, trying to avoid the carcass view. There we go. Little cutscene. <laughs> Solstice. Oh, where's the rabbit we blasted? There it is. <laughs> there we go. Next one. Well, we certainly have the uh, meat to cook now, which will be good <laughs> in between episodes. God, I forgot I had put Arthur in that pair of chops. I like those. Those look clean. <laughs> which, uh, I find the... Some of the stuff that... Well, now. We have a wolf doing a uh, play bow headstand. Yes. This wolf just wanted to play. <laughs> he wanted to play tag with his teeth. Right. Come on, Arthur. Walk the whole way around the tree. Get on the horse, and we'll go and collect the final roof. Get away from my kill, you damn raven. I actually heard a raven uh, the other day around uh, my place. They have a, a deeper right, hole than... Uh, you know, your standard crow. And they sound a little froggier. Okay. Oh, 
We just did this. Alright. Thank you for giving me back my mouse game. Few more wolves to add to the pile. Now we did timber wolves, now we have grey wolves. If the, as I was saying, yeah, we had uh, a raven. There's a, a hollow back behind my property. And a lot of different wildlife moves through, but uh, heard the raven. There were um, like four turkey vultures sitting on top of our barn roof the other day. And, uh, they used to nest, uh, there was an old farmhouse on the property behind ours that, uh, had been used as a clubhouse for, like, a eagle club. Uh, they did, like, field trials and stuff back there. But, um, they tore down the, the house as the club's been dissolved for a while and they haven't used it um but they built like a little uh, I don't know Kwanzaa hut type thing for you know lawn care equipment and all of that that they need to uh, maintain the property Since we are out hunting, I want... Well, it's only a th one star. Never mind. There's another one down there, though. Oh, that's three star. Yeah. But the uh, turkey vultures used to roost in the attic and nest in the attic of that old farmhouse. And uh, since they tore it down, they obviously need a new place to roost <laughs> and a new place to nest. And uh, we haven't used our barn for years, like years and years, except for storage and... Uh -oh. We used to have pigeons and quail and chickens and stuff that we had up in the hayloft once it was no longer a hayloft. So we really wouldn't mind if the uh, turkey vultures decided to move in there and yeah. nest. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Towards morning now. And, uh, what else? <laughs> what else have we seen lately? My mother thought she saw a bear in the front, uh, woodlot a couple days ago but uh, they're moving around a lot of the young males are searching for territory and they can have the males can have territory that spans up to why is my game so stuttery right now sorry side note that uh, the young males can have territory spanning up to, you know, 20 square miles as they have overlap with the females and they'll have, females will have four or five square miles and uh, so you have a male that'll be servicing good, all of those females 
<laughs> in the overlapping territories. And that means that the young males need to travel pretty far to find uh, a territory of their own after their mothers see you again, sir. run them Got off and you need. Have a look. say, hey, you need to move on because so you time for the... Uh, From what? You and that colored boy. I've mixed. rarely seen a pair so roostered. Yeah, that's <laughs> all a bit hazy. Ah, well, these things happen. Wow. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that comment. Yeah, okay. All right, then, let's have a look. But, um... Mm -hmm. What was I saying? <laughs> Keep looking. Let me know if there's anything else. Yeah, the, uh... So the young bears have to travel pretty far once, uh... The mother bears run them off. Tell them it's time for the next litter of cubs, so you need to move on. But it's not unusual to, to see bears in our area anymore. Still not really any hunting season for them down here in my part of the state. A little too close to Pittsburgh, but um... They are becoming more prevalent and uh, eventually they will need to probably establish a bear check station down here for bear hunting. Yeah. As the closest one is several counties away. Lord, what? <laughs> hey, stop right where you are. Time to die. I don't want to shoot the horses. Any more of you bastards? Oh, come on. There we go. Good plan, fellas. Not sure who these yokels are that keep, uh, trying to rob this place. Horses. Getting a little bit of a pain. This. <laughs> All right. Search the chest, Arthur. There's glitching through the uh, side of the. Uh... Hello, there's the chest. There we go. Arthur's glitching through the side of the wagon there. Couple of shires. 
Alright, there's one. <laughs> well, so much for getting the wagon out of the road. <laughs> Anyways, if you have enjoyed this episode, on, please give it a like and consider subscribing. And Arthur and Solstice and I will see you in the next episode. Bye for now.